I'm Matt Beecher in San Francisco for NAREACH REIT World, our 2018 annual conference. Joining me today is NAREACH's 2019 Chair, Sandeep Mathrani, CEO of Brookfield Properties Retail and Vice Chairman of Brookfield Properties. Sandeep, thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you, Matt. Thank you for having me. Now, as you begin your tenure as NAREACH Chair, how would you describe the REIT industry overall? You know, we've uh, just been part of the, uh, the uh, S&P. We have our own sector over the last year. Um, uh, business is actually quite good uh, across all REIT sectors, uh, contrary to belief even in the retail sector where uh, uh, we've actually had increasing income, increasing dividend. Uh, I think being separate in the, in the S&P sector has given us more visibility. Uh, we see that with the passive funds, the ETFs, uh, you, know, you know, getting into more investors. Um, Look, contrary to belief, rising interest rates means there's inflation. Uh, inflation usually is good for real estate. Uh, headline instantaneous reaction is a knee jerk that interest rates are bad for real estate. Uh, we've seen over and over again over the long term, inflation is what gives us some pricing power, uh, which is what we haven't had for the last decade. Now, what do you see as the biggest opportunity, as well as the biggest challenge, facing the REIT industry in this coming year? I, I think um, the opportunity really is we're starting to see the rising interest rates. So effectively, um, people don't have to speculate about it anymore. You can start to see the performance of the companies against a rising interest rate uh, environment. Uh, we, we've always talked about it. We've talked about it happening. It hasn't happened. Uh, it's been pushed, and now it's here. So I think getting that behind us uh, as a factor uh, on performance would be a good thing. That's the opportunity. Uh, I, I think, uh, you know, I think no one really talks about talent, um, but I think talent's a real issue uh, in our industry. You know, it's not an industry where people put first when they graduate up from Harvard Business School that they want to go to, or, or, uh, or actually use Chicago, which is the number one MBA school today in the country. Um, and, and so for us to have a proper program whereby we're recruiting from universities early in the game to build a pipeline of talent is something our industry has never done. Like the investment banking industry or the manufacturing industry or the management consulting industry, they actually have a pipeline of talent because they nurture them, they train them, they hire them out of school. Uh, and so what we find ourselves is that we're basically cannibalizing each other's companies for talent. And I think talent's a real, real issue. And in a tighter labor market, it even becomes a bigger issue. And lastly, what do you see as your top priority as Neary Chair? Look, uh, I, I think the biggest priorities are behind us when you look at tax reform. Uh, and and as, as, as the, the CEO of Neary likes to say, uh, you never know what's on the horizon. Uh, I, th I think you know the bigger part really is to make sure that you know the the uh, the uh, NARI uh, membership uh, feels that they're getting what they want. And I think as I sit through meetings year in and year out, uh, it seems the investor outreach program uh, seems to be the biggest on mind of every NARI member. How do you get the generalist investor to come and invest in our business? So if there was a way uh, to, to actually be able to uh, bring that to the forefront, that would be, uh, that would be uh, pretty good. Sandeep, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. For more from REIT World 2018, be sure to visit NARIT's website, REIT.com.